What if we hear? A little engineer poking around where he shouldn't. I wonder what this button does. <laughs> Was that the airlock? Silly me. Bye bye, little engineer. You're Duras Fane's daughter, Lorana? Lorana Fane? Why, yes, that's me. How did you guess? The ship is nearly under my control. Isn't it wonderful? The darkness is coming, but it won't take me. Lord Vivicar has taken control of your mind. You must resist. Lord Vivicar, the nice man who healed me, he warned me about you. But you're not going to kill me, Jedi. I won't let you. Let the darkness take me. Go away or I'll open the airlock. I'd rather die than be taken. Please, Lorana, I can shield you from the darkness. Lies! Lord Vivicar warned me about your lies. The Jedi just betray and kill each other, he said. He's going to make me his apprentice. Think on what the Jedi teach, Lorana. The code. There is... No emotion. There is peace. You're right. What have I done? I was going to visit my father. Then there was the ambush. And the healer came. Lord Vivicar. No. No, the darkness is coming. I can't stop it! Don't worry, Lorana. Everything's going to be all right. What? What did you do? You look so weak. But Lord Vivicar's voice is gone. The voice in my head. How did you do it? A shielding ritual. That blocks Vivicar's influence. The same ritual that saved your father. But it's taken a lot out of you. And the difference for me? It's like night and day. I just can't believe I let that monster make me do those terrible things. I'm sorry. I... I I'm going to lock myself in the brig until we reach a port. I don't trust myself. <laughs> 